guys, welcome back. This is Austin Linney with your Friday rant. What I'm going to talk today about, I don't even know why I did that weird voice, but you know, sometimes you just do weird stuff. I'm going to talk about mind hacking, right? And it's not really a term like I've like coined or anything. It's just something I do to, to help clients and you can help yourself too. We we're trying to remove everything from our life that we don't like. And perfection is the only thing that exists in this world. That's what we're after. But the problem is, is that subconsciously, there's so many things that we do that can't be changed overnight. And so instead of beating ourselves up for not doing the thing, you can kind of create different scenarios. And I'll use an example that I used when I was drinking too much and I wanted to get sober, right? You get these feelings that come over you, right? Whether you're hungry or you need a drink or, or you need to scroll or Netflix. And so instead of beating myself up for having the feeling, what I would do is anytime the feeling of needing to drink came over me, I would get on the Peloton for like 10 to 15 minutes. And what it did is, is a pattern interrupt in my mind. And most of the time, I would say 90% of the time when I tried this, I didn't drink afterwards because I, I, you know, my body got moving, my energy got moving, right? And then I did the same thing like, oh, if it came over me, I'd go on a walk and then I wouldn't drink, right? And, and we're trying to cut everything out of our life and say, you know, this is exactly how it needs to be. It's perfect. Instead of understanding that we're human beings and we're flawed and nine times out of 10, we just need a pattern interrupt, right? Nine times out of 10, you just need to understand the way that your mind works and do something against it, right? So instead of just being upset that you're not eating healthy, right? Here's another case for a client. It's very upset, trying to lose a lot of weight. And he's like, man, I, I you know, I, I was only like 80% good this week or like, you know, all that stuff. And it's like, yeah, but like, what were you beforehand? Well, I was like 10%. I was like, okay, well, let's shoot for like 50, like 60%. And then when we nail 60%, then we'll try to get 70% and 80%. And so that's the problem is that we, we think that we can go from, I never did the thing to perfection within like five days and it doesn't work like that. And so set up your your mind for ways to win so you can compound the winning and gain confidence that's going to create kind of uh, spurring you on to the next kind of level. But that's not what we do. We beat ourselves up. We say, oh, I'm not good enough. Uh, we say, I can't do it. We say, I don't even know why I'm trying, right? Does that sound familiar? Those sayings sound familiar because I know you've said them. So we have to understand how the mind works and then hack it backwards to create wins for us, right? Perfect. Another perfect example, um, you know, creating frictionless uh, things like putting your clothes out in the morning that you're going to wear in the gym in the morning so you're not looking for them, putting your keys next to your wallet, right? We do all these things and they get mad at ourselves because we're not doing it perfectly, but we're not setting ourselves up for success on the front end, knowing the way our mind works. So these little bitty tricks you can try to do to hack your mind. Hope everyone got some value from this and we'll see you next time. Guys, let me take a minute to tell you about my buddies over at Lead Hub, Ben and Aaron, the best humans I know. Not only are they amazing at marketing for trade companies, but Ben started his HVAC company in his garage, sold it for multi-million dollars. So when this guy talks, I listen. When we took over Deets Mechanical, we had 22 reviews in 22 years. In seven short months, we went from 22 reviews to 107. We went from a 4.2 to a 4.7. We tripled our Facebook presence and we tripled our calls. If you're an HVAC, plumbing, electric, landscaping company, and you're looking for a no BS approach to marketing, you're looking for people who have done it before, you got to go to leadhub.net. 